Hello everyone, welcome back to Pavli and today our topic is how to send 100 plus promotional messages with images on WhatsApp using AI Sensi. So here I'm managing my campaign and I want to promote my product so I want to send promotional messages on WhatsApp to all my contacts that I have in my Google Sheet. So in my Google Sheet I'm managing my contact details and as the new contacts will be added in Google Sheet then automatically a personalized and promotional message will be sent to all the contacts by using AI Sensi. So here for my objective, I have to build a connection between Google Sheets and AI Sensi. So for building this connection, I'm going to use Pabli Connect, which is an amazing software for automation and integration. Now with Pabli Connect, as the new contacts will be added in the Google Sheet, then automatically a promotional message will be sent on WhatsApp by using AI Sensi. So how I'm going to build this connection? For that, let me take you to my computer screen. I hope all you can see my computer screen and today we are going to see that how we can send 100 plus promotional messages with images on WhatsApp using AI Sensi. So AI Sensi is a platform designed to help businesses automate and manage their WhatsApp marketing and communication. It allows users to send bulk messages including promotional content, updates and images directly to their customers on WhatsApp. So AI Sensi integrates with the WhatsApp Business API, enabling businesses to send personalized messages at scale while maintaining compliance with WhatsApp policies. So in this video, we will explore how to efficiently send 100 plus promotional messages on WhatsApp using AI Sensi. So if you are managing a marketing campaign, especially during a product launch or a special promotion, reaching your audience quickly and effectively is crucial. So WhatsApp is one of the most direct and engaging channels for customer communication but manually sending promotional messages to a large audience can be incredibly time consuming. By using AI Sensi, you can automate the process of sending bulk promotional messages on WhatsApp, ensuring that your audience receives timely and personalized offers without the hassle of manual efforts. And this not only saves you time, but also increases the effectiveness of your campaign by leveraging WhatsApp high engagement rates. So in this video, I will guide you through setting up this integration with Pabli Connect so you can scale your marketing efforts and connect with your customers more effectively. So here I have my Google Sheet where I'm managing the detail of my contacts and here I'm going to add the detail of all the contacts to whom I want to send my promotional message. So here what I need to do is I need to connect Google Sheet with AI Sensi and now I want to send promotional messages to all my contacts that I have in my Google Sheet. So for this I need to build a connection between Google Sheet and AI Sensi without any coding and programming skills and that I'm going to do with the help of Pabli Connect. So for using Pabli Connect, I need to open a new tab and here I'm going to search for pabli.com slash connect in my browser. And this will take us to this landing page of Pabli Connect. Now here on this landing page, we have two options, sign in and sign up for free. If we don't have any account with Pabli Connect, then we can just click on this sign up for free button and this will take only two minutes of our time and we will get 100 tasks free every month. Or if we already have an account, we can just sign in and we will get to see this page. So these are all the apps that Pabli offers and we are going to use Pabli Connect here. So for using Pabli Connect, I need to click on this access now button under Pabli Connect. And this will direct us to the dashboard of Pabli Connect. Now here in the dashboard, what I need to do is I need to create a new workflow. And for that, I need to click on this create workflow button and this window will pop up. Now here in this window, I need to first give the name of my workflow. So I'm going to name it as my objective, which is to send 100 plus promotional messages with images on WhatsApp using AI Sensi. Now what I need to do is I need to click on create. And this will take us to this most important window of our workflow. Now here we have two boxes, trigger and action. So trigger and action are the two main principle on which our workflow works on. And these are the two main building blocks of our workflow. So here the trigger says when this happens, action says do this. So trigger is going to be the first step that will get executed in our workflow and action is just going to follow that. So here in our workflow, we need to first set up our trigger and in our workflow, we can only set up single trigger step and multiple action steps. So here for setting up my trigger, I'm going to first search for my trigger application. And here in my trigger application, I'm going to use Google Sheets. So I'm going to search for that. And I need to select Google Sheets here. And I need to give my trigger event. So I'm going to open this tab. A new or updated spreadsheet row will be my trigger event. So I'm going to select this. And now I need to connect Google Sheets with Pabli Connect in my workflow. 
and for that I need to use this Webhook URL. So this Webhook URL is going to work as a bridge between Google Sheets and Public Connect. Now for connecting these two applications, I need to follow all these instructions. And first I need to copy this Webhook URL. And now by using this Webhook URL, I'm going to connect my Google Sheet with Public Connect. Now I need to take you to my Google Sheet. And here in Google Sheet, I'm using this spreadsheet of WhatsApp marketing. And in this, I have these two column of contact name and the contact number. So here in my Google Sheet, I'm going to add the detail of my contacts to whom I want to send my promotional messages. And now here, what I need to do is I need to connect this spreadsheet with Public Connect so that I can send the detail of all my contacts to Public Connect and I can send promotional messages on WhatsApp to all these contacts. So for connecting the spreadsheet with Public Connect, I need to go to extensions and in extensions, I need this extension of Public Connect Webhooks. But if you don't have this extension, then what you need to do is you need to go to add-ons and you need to click on get add-ons. And this will direct us to the Google Workspace Marketplace. Now here, what we need to do is we need to first search for our extension. And here the name of my extension is Public Connect Webhooks. So I'm going to search for that. And here we will see our extension like this. So you need to first install this extension and I have already installed this. So I'm going to close this window. And after installing this extension, what we need to do is we need to first refresh our spreadsheet. And after refreshing the spreadsheet, we need to go back to extensions. And here we need to go to our extension of Public Connect Webhooks. And now we need to open Initial Setup. Now by using Initial Setup, we can connect this sheet or this spreadsheet with Public Connect. And we can send all the contact details from this Google Sheet to Public Connect. Now for connecting this sheet, I need to first give my Webhook URL. So I'm going to paste that Webhook URL that I've copied from Public Connect. So I'm going to paste that here. And now I need to give my trigger column. So here in my spreadsheet, I have this column B that is my last data entry column and the trigger column will be your final data column on which if the data is added, the whole of that row data will be sent to the Webhook URL. So here the trigger column is going to be column B. And now as the data will be filled in this particular column, then automatically and immediately the data of that whole row will be sent to Public Connect. Now what I need to do is I need to click on send test. And here my test data has been sent successfully. And now as the test data, I have sent the data of the first row. And now by using this test data, I can set up my workflow. And after setting up the workflow, I can send the promotional messages to all the contacts in just one click. Now I need to click on submit. And here my setup is configured successfully. So I'm going to close this. And here I have sent the data of this first row as a test data. And I have connected the spreadsheet with Public Connect. Now, as I'm going to add the data of a new contact in a new row, then automatically and immediately I want that data to be sent to Public Connect too. So for this, I need to go back to extensions. I need to go to Public Connect Webhooks. And here I need to enable this option of send on event. Now, after enabling this option, as I'm going to add the data of a new contact in my Google Sheet row, then automatically the data of that row will be sent to Public Connect. Now I need to take you back to Public Connect. And here in Public Connect, I have received this response. So in this response, I have my trigger column that is column B. I have my spreadsheet name that is WhatsApp marketing. I have the name of my contact that is demo user and I have the contact number. So here I've received the detail of my contact from my Google Sheet. And here I have received the test data of the first contact from my Google Sheet. Now by using this first contact, what I can do is I can set up my automation and my workflow. And by setting up my automation, I can send the promotional message to my contact that I have received from Google Sheet. And after setting up my workflow, I can automatically send hundreds of promotional messages to all the contacts that I have in my Google Sheet and also to the contacts that I'm going to add the details in my Google Sheet. Now here as I've received the detail of my contact, now what I need to do is I need to send a promotional message on WhatsApp by using AI Sensei. So for sending the message on WhatsApp and for using AI Sensei, I need to set up my action step. So I'm going to open this tab and here my action application is going to be AI Sensei. So I'm going to search for that and here I'm going to select WhatsApp by AI Sensei. Now I need to give my action event. So I'm going to open this tab and send template message will be my action event. So I'm going to select this and I'm going to connect WhatsApp by AI Sensei with Public Connect in my workflow. So I'm going to click on connect. I will click on add new connection. And now for connecting AI Sensei with Public Connect, I need to give my API key. So here, how I'm going to get this API key? For that, I need to first log into my AI Sensei account and I need to navigate to manage section. 
and in man section I'm going to find the API key option and in the API key I can generate my new API key and I can get my API key. So here for getting the API key what I need to do is I need to first take you to my AI Sensei account and here in AI Sensei I need to go to manage and now in manage I need to go to API key. So I'm going to open this option of API key and here in API key I can regenerate my API key so I'm going to click on this regenerate key button I will click on confirm and here it has generated this API key so I'm going to copy this API key I'm going to go back to public connect and I'm going to paste that here in this tab now I have added my API key so what I need to do is I need to click on save and here I've connected AI Sensei with public connect in my workflow now for sending the template message on WhatsApp and for sending the promotional messages to all my contacts, I need to give all these details. Now here first I need to give the campaign name and here I need to first create a campaign that I want to run for sending the promotional messages to all my contacts on WhatsApp. So here for the campaign, I also need my template. So for this, I need to again take you to AI Sensei. Now here I need to first take you to template message. And here in template message, I will see all the templates and I can create the new customized template that I want to use for sending the message on WhatsApp. So I'm going to first go to all and here these are all the templates that I've created in AI Sensei and for creating a new template, you need to click on this new button and after clicking here, you can customize the message that you want to send on WhatsApp to all your contacts or customers. And after customizing the message, you need to first take the approval of your template from AI Sensei and after taking the approval, you will see your template like this. So here I've created this template that is named as message with images. And here I'm going to use this template in my campaign. And I'm going to use this template for sending the promotional messages to all my contacts. So first I'm going to close this. And now here I need to create my campaign. So I'm going to take you to campaigns first. And here in campaigns, I need to first create a new campaign. So I'm going to click on launch button. And here I need to select this option of API campaign. So I'm going to click on next. And here I need to give my campaign name. So here my campaign name will be promotional messages. And now I'm going to first select my template that I want to use on my campaign. So I'm going to click here. And here I'm going to search for my template that is named as message with image. So here this is my template. So I'm going to select this. And here I'm going to use this template for sending the messages on WhatsApp. And I'm going to send the promotional messages. So here with this promotional message, I'm promoting my product of public connect and here I've customized this message and in this message, I have this variable where I'm going to add the name of my contact. And also with this message, I'm going to add the image of my product that I want to send as a promotional message on WhatsApp to all my contacts. So here with this message, I'm going to add my image and for sending the message on WhatsApp, I need to first set this campaign live. So I'm going to click on set live. I need to go to campaign. And here this is my campaign that is named as promotional messages. Now I need to take you back to public connect. And here I need to first give my campaign name. So I'm going to type my campaign name here. So here this is my campaign name. Now I need to give the mobile number of my contact. So here what I'm going to do is I'm going to use the response of my Google Sheet and I'm going to map the phone number or the mobile number that I've received from my response of Google Sheet and I'm going to map the mobile number of my contact. So for that I need to use mapping and what mapping is, mapping is a technique through which I can retrieve the data from the previous steps and the data that is changing will get replaced with the new data in the real time. So for mapping, I need to click here. I will open this response of Google Sheets and here this is the mobile number or the contact number of my contact. So I'm going to map this and here for the mobile number, I need to add the plus sign and the country code. So here the country code is already added in my contact number. I just need to add the plus sign before this mobile number. And now I need to give the user name. So I'm going to click here. I will open the response of Google Sheets. And here I'm going to add the name of my contacts. So I'm going to map that. And now here if I have to give any source, I can type that here too. If I want to give any tag to my contact, I can add that to here. And now here I have this tab of template parameter. Now here in this template parameter, what I'm going to do is I'm going to add the value of my variable that I have in my template and I add only one variable which is of username. So for my variable and the template parameter, I'm going to add the value of my variable which is of my contact name. So I'm going to click here. I will open this response of Google Sheets and here this is my contact name that is demo user. So I'm going to map this and now I have to give the URL. 
So here I need to add a publicly accessible URL of my image that I want to send with my message on WhatsApp to all my contacts. So here I'm going to add the URL of my image and here you can even add video URL, document URL and the image URL that you want to send with your message. So here I have to make sure that my URL is publicly accessible. So I'm going to add my URL here and now I have added my URL. So I need to give my file name. So here I have added the image URL of my product, which is of Pabli Connect. So I'm going to type that as my file name. And now I have added all the detail and I have mapped all these other detail here. Now what is going to happen is that as I have mapped all these detail, I have made these detail dynamic. So as I'm going to receive a new contact detail from my Google Sheet, then automatically all these details that I mapped here are going to get replaced with the new contact detail in the real time. And here I have left all these other tabs too. But if you want to fill these details, you can do that too. And if you want to send different images for all the messages to different contacts, then what you can do is you can add the image URL in your Google Sheet with the contact details. And you can also get the image URL from your Google Sheet. So you can map that URL here and you can send different image URL to different contacts that you want. Now here I have filled all the required details. So what I need to do is I need to click on save and send test request button. And here we can see I have received this response. So this is a positive response. And in this response, I have received this value of true. That means I have successfully sent the message on WhatsApp to my contact by using AI Sensei. So to check whether I have sent the message on WhatsApp to my contact or not, I'm going to open WhatsApp. Now here on WhatsApp, we can see I have received this message. So I'm going to open this message. And here we can see I have received this message and I have sent this message through demo user. So this was the name of my contact. And with this message, I have added this image. So this is the logo of my product, which is of Pabli. And here, this is my template message that I've added in my template and in my campaign in AI Sensei. So automatically by using AI Sensei, I have sent this promotional message to my contact that I have the detail in my Google Sheet. Now here I've successfully set up this workflow and now as I'm going to add a new contact in my Google Sheet, then automatically I can send a promotional message by using AI Sensei on WhatsApp to my contact. So here I've successfully sent this message on WhatsApp with images by using AI Sensei. Now I need to take you back to Pabli Connect. And here I've successfully set up this workflow and I've set up this automation between Google Sheet and AI Sensei. Now what I need to do is I need to take you back to Google Sheet and here I want to send promotional message to all my contacts that I have in my Google Sheet in just one click. Then what I need to do is I need to go back to extensions. I need to go to Pabli Connect Webhooks. And here I need to select this option of send all data. So after selecting this option of send all data, what can happen is automatically it will send the data of all the contacts that I have in my Google Sheet to Pabli Connect. And as I've set up my workflow in Pabli Connect between Google Sheet and AI Sensei, then by using that workflow and by using that automation, as we are going to receive all these contact detail in Pabli Connect, then automatically it will send promotional messages on WhatsApp to all these contacts by using AI Sensei. So after setting up your workflow in Pabli Connect, you need to go to extension, you need to select the option of send all event. And after selecting that option, you can automatically send promotional messages to all the contacts that you will have in your Google Sheet. And also if you are going to add the new contact details, then you can also send promotional messages on WhatsApp to that new contacts too. Now here I've successfully set up this automation and this connection between Google Sheet and AI Sensei. Now I need to take you back to Pabli Connect. And here I've created this connection between Google Sheet and AI Sensei to automatically send 100 plus promotional messages with images on WhatsApp using AI Sensei. So let's summarize what we did here. So first I've set up my trigger and my trigger application was Google Sheets and my trigger event was new or updated spreadsheet row. Then I've set up my actions tab and in my action application, I have used WhatsApp by AI Sensei and my action event was send template message. So this is how I have successfully created this workflow and you can also create this workflow by following all the steps that I did in my workflow. And I'm also going to put the link of my workflow in the description so you can check it out from there. And thank you for watching this video. Not just this application, you can automate and integrate a lot more application like this by using Pabli Connect. So if you want to reach out to us, then email us at support at the rate pabli.com. And if you have any queries, then you can write us at forum.pabli.com. And if you have any issue with the pricing, then you can visit this link. And if you like this video, then please like, share and subscribe. Thank you.